right, so I know you guys are tired of seeing me in the back. Look at the little rubber ducky. Yeah, rubber ducky. Uh, I know you guys are tired of seeing me in the bathroom, but listen, man, I had some bacon cheese last night. I gotta gotta watch my diet. That's, uh, and you know what? That's the only thing that's gonna get me ripped and lean. But like I said in the last video, um, I, I, if it's not fun, I don't want to do it. So cookies, yes. Cakes, yes. Um, macaroni cheese, yes. Cheesecake, yes. Um, I'm gonna try to you know make sure that I work out enough to keep my metabolism going so I can burn it all, you know, burn it all up. Um, but I know you guys are tired of seeing me in the toilet, so we got to show you a little bit of my shoulder exercise. I'm gonna do one round of each and try to add um, you know little notes on the screen. All right, so I'm gonna do a little bit of my shoulder workout. Watching some YouTube videos, uh, you know, gotta love that Chromecast. Can't wait to get the new one. Yeah, the little colors. I think I'm gonna get the blue one. Um, but anyway, let me get back to this uh, shoulder workout. You know, yes, I flushed. Yes, I washed my hands. Cause it's nasty if you don't. Uh, a little home workout for you. Hold on. Okay, so I actually started off with uh, the 15s. Did some side lateral raises. I don't know if you could tell, but you know, I'm trying to get my pinky uh, high on the, uh, like when I raise. Um, and, uh, you know, Rich Piano always talks about pumping. So what I try to do is uh, just continue, you know, to pump for, it starts to burn around maybe 15, 20. And um, at this point, I was only doing, this is my, uh, my uh, fourth set. Uh, I think... Uh, yeah, th this was uh, my fourth set. I had stopped and went to the bathroom earlier. But then I go into, uh, you know, some quick uh, shoulder presses uh, to work the front delts. Uh, side laterals work the side delts, obviously, and front press work the uh, front delts. And then, um, you know, upright row. I, I don't know. I mean, I, I feel it in my traps. I kind of feel it in my, uh, my rear delts a little. Um, maybe a little in the side delts, depending on, you know, the elbow placement. Uh, but then, you know, right from there, I go straight into overhead press. Uh, and I like to come behind the neck because I feel like it gives me more of a stretch, uh, you know, on my shoulders. Um, my elbow is a little, you know, tweaky. So I didn't really, uh, you know, put too much into, um, you know, doing them that hard. And that's it. All right. So I finished the shoulder workout. Uh, wasn't. I don't know, didn't really sweat, didn't didn't really feel like a, a full, you know, good workout. You know, working out at home for me is not the same as going to the gym. Uh, like when I go to the gym, uh, it's a different atmosphere. So working out at home, you know, it is what it is. Uh, but I had to stimulate the muscle, I had to get the blood moving somehow. So, you know, that's what I did. Uh, I'm about to hop in the shower. You can kind of see my traps a little, a little bigger. You know, I like to look at my shoulder as like a three-headed monster. It's like the front delt, you got the side delt, and you got the rear delt. Uh, and sometimes they pop, sometimes they don't. Um, I don't feel like they pop that much today, but you know. But here's a quick question for for any of you uh, lifters or fitness enthusiasts: like I'm starting to get a little pain in my elbow. Um, you know, whenever I, I, I train tricep or, or shoulder or anything kind of pressing motion, what would be the best solution? I mean, should I get one of those like little little sleeves or should I just get some cream? Should I just suck it up and, you know, fight through it? But anyway, it's your boy, J-R-A-J-S-M-O, deuces.